Hello. It is freezing, hence I'm wearing my hoodie. This is what it looks like. Uh, and I'm leaving it on because I'm cold. So there you go. And we have the next Illumicrate Afterlight box. This is the November box. It just arrived today whilst I was out at work. So we're gonna open this up. I already know what the book is because they announced it. Uh, I can't actually remember the name of it now, but they announced it because they were doing an add-on for the companion novel to this book that was already out. So this is the new release, but spoiler alert by Olivia Dade was the first book in this companion series that was out. I did actually read that at the weekend. I liked it, didn't love it. Uh, so we did have the option of ordering the add-on of that particular book exclusively in hardcover and I decided not to do that and actually I'm really glad that I did decide not to do that because I didn't love that book which potentially doesn't bode well for this book but I guess we'll see. Anyway let us get into this particular box as I said Afterlight it oh the book is called all the feels anyway let us look at what is in this box i think that it's that they said there's going to be two items looks like there are three items uh the first one looks like it might be another kilner jar i'm confused this is the same, is this the same Kilner jar as last time? I don't know, there's no way for me to check because I don't, I think I mentioned in another Illumicrate unboxing that I put mine through the dishwasher and the, this, this design thing came off. So I, I don't know if it's the same one. Did it say on the, I'm confused, it's not on the spoiler card either. So. I'll have to watch some other unboxings and see if anybody else knows why we've got this again. But hey, cool, I've got it again and it actually has the thing on it and this time I won't put it in the dishwasher. So that's that's good. Um, so yeah, I, th there's two other items in here. The first one is a sleep mask, that's so cute. Hang on, I'm just gonna open this. Oh, cute. I'll put it on so that we can, it doesn't have an adjustable thingy, so it's a bit tight for me to be honest, but it's pretty good. Uh, I get headaches super easily, so I possibly won't use this one uh, because it would probably give me a headache, but it's a very cute item. And then we have, I think, a mug. Like it's gonna be so annoyed. <laughs> oh, it's just a plain, plain black mug with Moonlight Readers Club reading the night away. I mean, that's relatable, isn't it? But it's a cute, cute little mug, just white inside. I like that. I like that. That's cute. Very cute. Can I put that there. Can you see it? I mean. It's so small and far away that you can't really, but hey, that doesn't matter. And then we have the book. So, da 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 da, All the Feels by Olivia Dade, a match made in Hollywood, and we have pink sprayed edges, and I think think that it is size signed and it's got a little message in it that's so cute it's a digital signature not a um not a you know original signature it says if you ever live out the only one bed trope in real life may it bring you just as much delight as it does alex olivia date oh is it an only one bed trope i love that i do like that trope i have to admit and then it's navy blue under the dust jacket. So let us read the synopsis then. Catch a falling star. 
Alexander Woodrow has it all. Charm, wealth, a starring role on the biggest show on TV, but the showrunners have wrecked his character, he's hounded by old demons and his future remains uncertain. When all that reckless emotion explodes into a bar fight, the tabloids and public agree his star is falling. Enter Lauren, the former ER therapist hired to keep him in line. Compared to her previous work, watching over a handsome but impulsive actor shouldn't be especially difficult. But the more time she spends with Alex, the harder it is to hold on to her professionalism and her heart. When another scandal lands him in major hot work, water and cost Lauren her job, Alex becomes determined to keep his impossibly stubborn and extremely endearing minder in his life any way he can. And on a road trip up the California coast together, he intends to show her exactly what a falling star will do to catch the woman he loves. So it's just going to be a bit cute and yeah, sounds good. Sounds good. I'll read it at some point. I'm still undecided about this box, if I'm being honest, but We'll see what the kind of teaser is for the next book and go from there. I know that some of you were interested in me unboxing more of these, so I kept it for this time. We'll see if I carry on. I think maybe I'll decide based on, uh, you know, whether the book calls to me. I do like the sound of this one, especially if it has the only one bed trope, which it didn't mention that in the synopsis, but the author wouldn't put that in note if it wasn't there so we'll see I will eventually at some point in the future report back on that and that is it for this one thank you so so much for watching if you like this video and want to see more like this from me then do think about hitting that subscribe button and I hope to see you here again soon thanks bye